accept the defense coming into this game? As well as you played so far, I think there were still question marks. At least people say, well, they haven't played any less. Mm -hmm. Do you think those question marks are answered at least a little bit now? Uh, I think a little bit. I think there will be more people uh, giving us some props and stuff. But we still made a lot of mistakes, left a lot of plays out there. And we got a lot of opportunities where we could have could have made some plays, got some critical stops. So we still got a lot of things to work on. But, but yeah, I think we proved to, to ourselves and our, our team and, uh, and some other people that, that we do have a, have a, def a defense that, that will compete and will fight the whole game and, and can make some plays, no matter who we're playing. What was, what was so tough about Booker tonight? Uh, they just, uh, they did a great job of just pulling guards, using the little, uh, the tight end off, motioning back and forth. Wilson does a great job of riding them and uh, making it. You don't know who's gonna who's gonna get the ball if he's gonna keep it or if he's gonna pull it. So they just use them in a very effective way. And then we had to uh, first half they gashed us for a couple couple big runs, but I think we uh, we settled down, made some adjustments at halftime, and and contained them a little better. When you were on the sidelines at the end of the game, and Jared's had a kind of game that he's had tonight, which you've probably never seen before, and uh, all of a sudden he's moving the ball down the field, running the ball, throwing the ball. We're at the 20 yard line. What were you thinking? Uh, I mean, throughout the game, no, I had no doubt that that we were going to make plays to win the game. That we were going to that we were competing. We were going to play the whole game, and the offense was going to going to move the ball. When they're moving the ball on that last drive, that's just what we expected. That's what we expected them to do, and and play the next play. Whether they get a 60 yard touchdown or it's an incompletion or a turnover, we just expect them to play the next play, and and the offense just fought all all night long. And it's just you know, hats off to Utah. They're a great team, and they. They got some great players over there, but we just we fought to the very end of the game and, and gave ourselves a chance at the end of the game. What do you what do you say to, to Goff right now? Like how do you kind of make him feel better? I mean, I just tell him to keep his head up, and I still pick him out of out of all the quarterbacks to to play within the Pac-12. And you know, you live and you learn. You're not gonna. We're all human. We're all gonna make mistakes. And and it wasn't like he's just out there all his fault. Like some of the balls got tipped, got got batted. So it's just different things and. I'm, hey, I'm excited to see what he's going to do next week on Thursday on ESPN again. Yes, he's going to he's going to go back to work and he's going to be ready to go.